Due to an oath of service, it has come that I must stand within this foreign country on this strange enchanted land to raise the ancient temple so long lost beneath the sand of time and man's corruption. And thus must I have at hand both sword and mason's trowel so to serve the Lord's command. Princes, kings, and potentates sent us all across the shore to cut down the infidels in a bloody holy war. They promised righteous glory, even life, forevermore. And so we battled inward, boldly taking on the chore, serving up our enemy to the mercy of our Lord. But in a lonely vigil, on a cold and eerie night, blew a moaning, mournful wind that filled my heart with fright. I, glimpsing an invader, thrust my sword with all my might into an airy phantom, my own shadow by moonlight. And thus my eyes were opened, and my soul was given sight. Within that silent moment, I was graced with light shot through, and for what seemed an hour, yet within a breath or two, I was freed from all my sin, and stood with the Christ anew, as he vanquished my true foe, not pagan, Muslim, or Jew, but the hubris, hate, and greed, sitting on my heart's back pew. And now I know my duties are most truly to protect, the cross from all dishonor and the temple to erect. Not with metal sword or tool, but by love must I perfect the sight of Christ's next coming, where his light shall intersect the heart of a true brother, though he's of another sect. So I take the sword and trowel as the tools that I must test, not upon a foreign land, but within this human breast to conquer evil forces and intolerance arrest, building a fraternity that will serve the noble quest to spread illumination and true glory manifest. <laughs>